Hey guys, so this is Alicia from LBCC Historical and what I wanted to do today is to show you some of the glass bottles um, that we offer in the shop with our products and I wanted to go over how to open them because they are all sealed with sealing wax and uh, it's pretty tough stuff. This bottle right here is what our waters come in and you can see where the cork is and then this bottle right here is a bottle that is filled with the water so you know here's the cork here's where the cork ends and you can actually see in the sealing wax where the cork ends as well and that's what you're actually looking for when you want to open your bottles so here's another example this is our bottle for the gypsy astringent and um, here's the gypsy astringent that is filled and sealed and you can actually see here's the cork here's where the cork is for this one and you can always tell because here this is going to always be a larger area and then it's going to get really small and then you're going to have the top and so where small is where you're going to want to take your scissors and open it and I'll show you exactly how to do that in just a moment. So we have our gypsy astringent right here. We have our Florida water and our orange water and we'll have rose water. Um, we're going to do all kinds of waters. This is a water as well. I'm not sure if we're going to keep these bottles yet or not. They're really cute. Um, but this is lavender water. And here again, you can see the top. You can see where it gets really small. And then you can see where it gets really large in the neck of the bottle. This right here is our 1772 lemon scrub. And um, you can actually see right here where the neck is big and then it gets small and then it gets wider. So right here in the small area is where you're gonna wanna um, take your scissors to get it open. And last but not least, we have our rouge bottle. Um, we have different types of rouge. So far they've all come in these really cute um, bottles with the corks. And you can see that uh, here it's large. It, get, it does get a little smaller right here, and then here it gets large again. So it's wherever you see that indentation in between the two large areas, that small indentation, that's where you're going to want to cut. So let me show you exactly how to do it. I'm going to take this bottle of Gypsy Astringent here, and I'm going to show you exactly how to open it. So first you're going to need a scissors. Don't use your good fabric scissors, that'd be really bad. But basically, you're going to find your area, which is right here, okay, because this is large, this is large, this is the smallest area. So you're going to find your smallest area, you're going to open your kitchen scissors, okay, and you're going to clamp down, and you're going to rotate, okay, you're going to rotate the bottle, not the scissors, okay, and this is not, not even a really strong scissors at that. But just rotate the bottle, not the scissors. You're going to be able to see that we've got it cut off. So once we've done that, you can see that um, the scissors has actually pushed up the cork a little bit. Remember, you're rotating your bottle in a circle. You're not rotating the scissors. You're just clamping down hard on that area. And you should be able to pry up the cork very carefully. Just in case some sides maybe didn't get it, you're going to want to rotate your cork back and forth, and voila. So as you can see, I have it completely sliced, and then what you're going to do is you're just going to pop it off, just like that. Okay. Now, um, your bottles will stay sealed. Make sure your scissors are sharp, be careful, don't cut yourself. Um, but this is the historical method of uh, sealing bottles. Okay, so here are some of the bottles we have in our shop. And I hope you've enjoyed this little tutorial. Follow us on Facebook and check out our Etsy page at www.littt3ts.etsy.com.